come to Lincolnshire, UK to understand more about our customers' conditions, to get into the Baltic Smile, and really understand more about the challenging conditions they face. So we've got a small chain of hills behind us and we are next to the sea. So we've got a lot of moisture coming in here every evening and therefore it's very green and, and wet out here. And that's what we are here for, to see these conditions. We're here to prove that we can deliver in this very challenging condition for our customers with performance, uptime and cost of operations reductions. It's critical for our team to understand what's needed for the extra fine cut and premium residue packages. So this here would be the typical condition we face here in this area. So we've got a skyfall variety winter wheat. And what you can see here, the soil is still pretty wet. So we had a lot of rainfall the last days. Um, so the lower part of the plant is also still green and it's pretty tough. So if you, if you twist it, you can actually form into a bale, pretty tough straw. But then at the same time, it's uh, drying off, it's windy and we've got sun coming in. So it gets pretty brittle at the top. So the threshing is very easy, but then also separation uh, is tough at the same time. And that's very challenging for uh, setting combines and getting the machine run properly and perform well. So what is important is to have the easy solution or the cleaning shoe. So in some conditions uh, you have more shoe load to one side of the machine. And that's always different if you have a single rotor machine, a twin rotor machine, an hybrid machine or whatever operation concept is. So that's what we are checking for now. So like in June, early July time frame, it's been too dry and therefore those kernels are really small and uh, they didn't get enough water. The challenge with those is they are really hard to clean out. So if you take the fan speed too high, you would actually blow them off. And also they are tough thrashing if they are sitting in the, in the upper part of the heads of the awn. Alright, so we've thrown around 180 lost trays today um, and now it's 8 o'clock, um, it's getting moist, so we are reaching the dew point, so it's getting really sticky now and we're going to start our last test right now. So as soon as the sun goes down, everything gets really moist and wet and you can feel the difference right away. impressed with the machine so far, especially with the separator and with the cleaning shoe, so it's going really well.